Hey guys, welcome to my channel. In this video, I'm going to solve this Rubik's Cube with one foot. So if you've seen any cubing competition videos from before 2020, you'll probably hear that they had 3x3 with feet as an event. It got removed from the WCA about four, four and a half years ago. So I'm going to bring it back, but make it more challenging by solving this 3x3 with only one foot instead of two. I actually did sprain my ankle in a pogo stick incident, so that kind of delayed some of the videos I was hoping to make, but it won't stop me from doing another crazy challenge. So, gave me another idea, so that's what I'm gonna do. First, I need to scramble this cube and then start probably what is gonna be a pretty hard challenge because it's hard to even turn a cube <laughs> with one foot. It's hard to turn it with two feet, I mean. If you think about it. Yeah, so that's what I'm gonna do. Okay. I think that'll work. Now I need to inspect the cube. And then, let's start. Okay, so I got the cube scrambled, let's start. Alright, and it's really loose, it feels like it's gonna pop. Here it is. Alright, so, this is my first turn, oh, 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 okay, this is gonna be hard, <laughs> this is gonna be pretty hard, so let's make this a time lapse, and in just one more turn, we have We have a cross complete. Here it is. This is going to be a lot of work. I'm like pretty much limited to the amount of moves I can make. There's my first step to all bear, by the way. So I have to keep doing cube rotations. Like all the moves I can do are either like D's, R primes, or L's. I cannot do use. They just turn the whole cube if I do that. Oh! It popped! I really hope that's a possible combination. Okay, I really hope that helped. Let's get on with the solve. Ah! There's that second F2L pair. Guys, I'm not kidding. This is actually hard. I'm, I'm like forgetting which side I'm supposed to be facing. It doesn't really matter that much doing F2L, but OLO and PLO are gonna be hard. And I finished F2L. Now let's see what OLO case I have, and hopefully it's not, it's not coin of twist, great. No edge flips, no corner twists, let's just hope we don't get PLO Perry because it popped and I had to switch a couple pieces around. So, I'm just gonna start this OLO algorithm and hope PLO goes fine while I'm doing this. Here's my PLO guess, what's it gonna be? It is a... 
deep harm. Oh dear. Let's see if I get this wrong and mess it up, or if I finish this. Alright! Final turn! You... Two! And there we go! I solved it! That was a pretty hard challenge. Look at that. Okay. I solved it. <laughs> that was a hard challenge. Okay. Alright guys, thanks for watching my video. I hope you enjoyed it. Since I already, some kind of accident happened, I just had to make the best of it by doing a crazy challenge on YouTube. And when my ankle gets better, I'm going to get on making that video I was going to make for 400 subscribers. I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.